What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Spartan Money YouTube channel. We got a lot of stuff to talk about today, so stay tuned. Alright, so we're gonna start off here on the simple mining dashboard. Today is Thursday. Sorry for the late video that you guys will be seeing. Tomorrow is free hash Friday. So I hope you guys will be uh you know tuning in for that. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be a fun time. So I hope to see a bunch of you guys there. But let's go ahead and take a look at what's going on. So we have the 1070 TIs. It's four of them. And they are pulling 124.43 mega hash on Ethereum. 61 is the highest temperature that I have on them. And these are my overclock settings. Minus 50 core, 1100 on the memory, 115 on the power limit. And you can see the rest. They've been running rock solid lately. I have had no issues with them. Um, so I'm, I'm really happy with how it's going. Also, I have the 560 rig, which I uh, was messing with yesterday. I'll have some more pictures of it um, here coming up once I get a chance. There's a lot of stuff going on right now, uh, possibly coming into a large amount of cards. So that's going to be exciting. I might be really close to hitting that one giga hash mark that I've been trying to reach. So uh, that's good news, exciting news for me. It's going to be exciting news for the channel, and I hope you guys are excited for me, and hopefully everything goes right. So the 560 rig is now a 12-card 560 rig. It is running on the Azrock Killer Z270 board that I showed you yesterday in the video. And they are running at 14 and a half across the board. Some are running a little more, some are running a little less. I have them underclocked just a tad bit. Uh, just to you know save on some power etc but 174 mega hash on 12 cards that are 560s is not bad at all six of them are msi aero itx five of them are gigabyte rx 560s and one is the asus rock strix 560 which i might be trading that one to brandon to get another msi aero itx 560 but we'll see <clears throat> so uh, the highest temperature is 64C. That card is actually sitting right beside the power supply. That's why it's so high. Otherwise, you know, everything will be around 61 at most and a little bit lower on all 12 cards. And the overclock settings across the board is 10, 1050 on the core, 2100 on the memory, and 825 on the core undervolt, 3 on the power stage. You can see the rest. Total power draw for these 12 cards with risers and everything is running off of one power supply. It's a Corsair RM1000X. <clears throat> Total power draw on Ethereum is 818 watts. So uh, not too bad for, you know, getting almost 180 mega hashes. You know, some people like 560s, some people don't like 560s. You know, some people would rather just buy six cards or whatever the case may be, seven cards, who knows, but... Um, I wanted to build out a 12 card rig of 560s and it is here. So now the next plan is going to see if I can try to get them all to be matching, which might be a struggle, but Brandon does have an MSI Aero ITX, so I could be at 7 and then I would have, you know, the other 5 would be the, gig the Gigabyte cards. But, you know, who knows? Maybe we can get something worked out, figured out. But they are running rock solid. I'm happy at how they are performing. If you would like to know how much these pull on uh, XMR, it is around 5 kilohash, I believe is what it is. Uh, so it does really good on XMR as well. I'm, uh, I'm happy with it. But that is the 560 rig. Again, I will have pictures and stuff upcoming about this rig, showing you everything in it. <clears throat> that will be coming up later on in a couple, in one of the other videos later on this coming up weekend or next week. And then we have the 7 card 580 rig. It is 6 MSI RX 580 Gaming X 8 gig models and then one MSI RX 580 MK2. That one, the MK2, is pulling 31.76 mega hash and the other ones are pulling, you know, 31, 31 and some change. I did bump up the overclocks just a tad bit and the highest temperature on that is 54, 56C. <clears throat> so, take a look at the overclock settings 1200 core. 2225 on the memory, 850 on the undervolt, 3 on the power stage. You can see the rest of it. 
All of my cards are BIOS modded, except for the 1070 Ti's, obviously. <clears throat> there are four more cards that you don't see right now. One is a Sapphire Nitro Plus 580, and then one is a 570 Gaming X that you don't see that is pulling 60 mega hash. And then two more that you don't see are two gigabyte 1050 Ti overclocked that are pulling right at 29, almost 30 mega hash. So with all the stuff so far, I am at 603 mega hashes now with the, uh, the mining room, the mining farm, the mining bucket, uh, the, the garden, you know, my singular plant. Apparently people were upset that I called it a farm, which I don't really care uh, because, uh, you know, this is a large amount of hashing power and you can, you can uh, go somewhere else. Anyways, I'm extremely happy to have hit this mark. Uh, today, I have came across something that will maybe put me in the range of 900 mega hash close to a thousand uh, mega hashes so I will be at my mark for what I wanted to actually reach um, quite a bit sooner than I was anticipating and uh, yeah but you know sometimes things just fall right into your lap that you weren't expecting so I'm, uh, I'm pretty excited about that but you know anyways I'm happy where it's at it's it's good for me. It's I you know a lot of it's came from you know the community support and you know just you know a lot lot a lot of good people in the community and a lot of good people that are in the Discord. So you know, thank you so much. You know I don't get um you know we're not getting paid to do any of this. Like we're not getting paid to you know like you know YouTube or whatever. So we're just doing it for fun right now because we're in the waiting you know phase of queue. But, you know, the people in the community have helped out, you know, a ton, as in, you know, giving us good deals on trying to get cards, you know, trading stuff around and stuff like that. Brandon, you know, Zal, Puggy, Raid Set, you know, all these guys, Tim, you know, a lot of good guys in our community. And it's like, pretty much we're just swapping cards back and forth with each other. So, you know, a huge thanks to everybody in the community. We, ha we have a lot new, a lot more new faces in the community so i'm excited for that and yeah so the plan is right now is mining ethereum tomorrow is free hash friday i hope you guys are going to be excited for it because i am super excited for it especially for tomorrow because i'm going to go check out potentially getting 18 more graphics cards <laughs> so yeah that's going to be that plan for tomorrow and um yeah so if i don't show up tomorrow night around 7 p.m central standard time go looking for me because that means something happen but i don't think anything's gonna happen anyways that's where we're at for this i did see a lot of people asking about electronium in the discord and comments and stuff like that i tried mining electronium through simple miner on claymore it didn't work i tried mining it on xmr stacked and i lost like three kilohash and then what to mine is completely off and what it says you're supposed to be getting right now. So I'm not mining Electronium at this point in time. I still hold Electronium and hopefully it gets all situated and fixed out so I can start mining it again because I do like Electronium. Um, in other news, I still have a Pigeon. I still have a large amount of Pigeon. I still am going to be mining Pigeon from time to time. So nothing's changed on that point. Uh, I still am going to be mining a Monero and stuff and things like that. But uh, tomorrow, hopefully, I'll have some good news that I can share with everybody about, you know, the potential increase to the farm or garden or bucket or bathtub or whatever anybody wants to say it is. Um, but I'm going to call it my farm. And if you don't like it, then I don't give. So anyways, that's going to be it for this video. If you like the video, please hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Don't forget, comment down below. Hit the notification bell so you can see whenever something else comes out. Check us out on Facebook, Reddit, and the Discord. All that stuff will be in the links down below, as well as links to the cards for the 12-card rig. If you guys want to check that out, you can check them out. If not, that's fine, too. Uh, I do encourage everybody to join the Discord channel. There's a lot of active people. We have a lot of awesome people in there. So please be sure to check that stuff out. And I also have the email that will be linked in the description below if you need to contact me with serious inquiries. So with that one, that's it. And until the next one, peace.